You want to change your Squarespace template, but without completely starting over from scratch. In this video, I'm gonna walk you through how to do that and what to expect throughout the process. Before you start, I recommend making a note of all of your design settings within the style editor. This means writing down fonts, font sizes, and colors because these settings will not transfer when you switch templates and if you want to keep your branding cohesive, it's easier to just have this information written down. You can preview and switch templates as much as you want. To try out a new template, you'll just go to design template and then select which template you want to preview on your site. This will not affect your current site at all while you're previewing the new template. You can actually just try out and see what your current content would look within the new design. Now it might look a little bit different because the new preview template will have just default design settings, not the current fonts and colors that you actually have on your live site. Now, even though previewing a new template won't affect your current site, there are certain changes that will affect your current site if you make them. So you can go ahead and change your headers, your footers, and play around with the page order, but if you make any changes to page content, images, blog posts, or anything like that, it's going to reflect on your live site. So be careful when making any changes within the new template you can actually switch back and forth between editing your preview template and your live site. Once you've gotten the new template to a good place and you're ready to launch, you just tell Squarespace to set this as the live template and that will now be your new site design. After this is done, you will need to adjust your pages. The demo pages from your new template will need to be deleted and you'll bring your actual site pages into the main navigation area. If you have any other Squarespace questions, be sure to let me know in the comments below. And if you found this video helpful, make sure to hit subscribe, like, and share it with your friends.